What is up, everybody? Welcome back to Let's Play Jack and Daxter, the Precursor Legacy. And we are picking up where we left off, about to enter into the Forbidden Jungle, and I'm looking over here first. Clear out some of these guys. And some good news about this place, when you kill your enemies, I do believe they stay dead until you die. So that's just a nice reminder. Simple platforming here, jumping around, getting out of the Precursor Orbs, and then a scout plane. That's our first one for the Forbidden Jungle. Well learned. And. Uh, damn, damn, damn. Oh man, I'm taking a hit. I'm taking a couple of hits here. One good thing is once you've uh, collected it though, you don't have to recollect it. Like like you did in Banjo Kazooie. Once you got it, you got it. So that's, that's something that's pretty cool. Damn, that guy. He kept jumping around me. But alright, got that taken care of. I'm trying my best not to take another hit or I'm gonna die and start over. Well, not all over. They're gonna, they're gonna bring me back to the, uh, the bridge, the main, uh, the beginning part of your section you're in. So, I'm trying to get all these orbs. I don't want to miss one. These snakes are the worst enemies in here because I can never judge how far away, yeah, see? I can never judge how far away they are. Where I can spin them or hit them or anything. That's alright. So a couple of enemies come back. I ain't worried about them. I ain't going after them now. So let's come over here. Grab some more precursor herbs. Get rid of that guy. Yeah, those things will come back out though. Just knock them down. But they will come back out. And I'm just making sure I ain't missing anything. And let's cross this bridge. There's actually something we gotta do below us. But I think I'll do that in a little bit. Come over here first. The and these guys that I just killed, little purple guys, what we call workers. Get used to them, you will see them often. And those yellow crates are like explosive crates. I don't even don't even touch them. Just leave them. Alone. Simple platforming, jump around, get precursor orbs. Yeah, I, I really enjoy this game. I hope you guys will enjoy it as much as me. Like, legit, like I love this game. I think I got them all. Let's check. Oh, there's one more up there. There's gotta be a way. There's gotta be a way to get it. Have y'all seen any blue eco around here? Maybe it's over there. I'm missing one. It's bothering me. That is going to bother me. I'm missing two. Hmm. You come up here. Let's take a look around over here. Cause there's probably some blue eco somewhere that's gonna let me do that. Otherwise, how am I supposed to get there? I'm just gonna fly over here. There's two. Is that one of maybe? No. Now I know in a second I will have the blue eco vents open. And maybe that's what I should go do first. I think that's what I'm going to do first. Because you need these uh, blue eco vents open to activate a lot of shit. So I think that's what I'll do first. In this world is uh, head over there. That's where I gotta get to go open it. So I'll activate all the blue eco vents. And then I can really. Uh, come on, I attacked off the thing. There we go. Now we gotta come over here. Oh, oh! And it makes the bridge for us. So that's nice. Alright, jump across, jump, jump, jump across. Get the door open real quick. And we're gonna go ahead and climb this thing. Oh, that sounds good to me. We're here, we're gonna go ahead and do it. Eco, and pretty much you can take this all the way up if you so desire without really stopping. Just gotta fly. There's three. And these are jump pads. So just hit X on them. Okay. Watch out for the workers being out of the Alright, now this is very. Oh shit. It's tricky. Jump on him. Let's go. Cause now you gotta time your jumps. 
And if anyone knows me, I suck at timing my jumps. But I did pretty good on this one. Alright, I'm gonna power sail. Bang. Just like that, baby. Step on the button. Takes us back down. And if I'm not mistaken, the blue weeko should be activated now. No, no, no. No, I, I think I am mistaken. Yes, it's down here that I, I have to get. I gotta come up here, I guess, first. Because I know what I'm looking yes, for. I gotta got find a bunch of blue Yes, we here, but you aren't powered up with the blue stuff. So it ain't gonna help us! Damn it. I hope this thing come back. I really hate these, because I really suck at jumping sometimes. I just saw on Banjo-Kazooie. So I'm gonna come over here. I really try and use my shadow just like in Kazooie, but you know, sometimes it just doesn't work that way. Oh, here we go. This is where we get the blue Wego turned on. We'll get this taken care of real quick. This one shouldn't be too hard. Got this power cell. We just left it out for us. How nice of them. We're starting to rack up here on power cell, guys. It's real nice. And see? Voila! The blue Wego vents are now. Have been activated all over the world. I knew there was a way to turn them on. There must be places to turn on the other eco vents as well. Yeah, before I leave this temple, I'm going to make sure I check everywhere. There's a lot of stuff you got to do with this blue eco. I'm going to head, head out this way. But there is a lot of stuff you got to do with this blue eco. Head this way. Oh my god, you suck. That's alright, I got it. To that point. Okay, right here, jump. Precursor awards. And we have a first, like, little boss fight coming up here, guys. It's gonna be a fun. He's, he's a nice and a uh, nice. He's an easy boss fight. Nothing really to worry about. Except for that. And this is where we can hit him. When he brings up the leaves for us to jump on. And then he's gonna send out his minions and try and hit us. Fight us, should I say. And you can't hit those guys when their spikes are out. You gotta... Oops. You gotta wait. I think we gotta do it three times. He's gonna send out minions. And we gotta bite, avoid his bite. I'll do three bites, I'm not mistaken. Pop off the leaves. Hey, that might be it. Pretty sure that's it. Because it's out of power cell. Now this is one thing a lot of people did not realize they needed to do. Was once you kill it, and it's dead and defeated, that's great. You gotta jump on it a couple times. Because he was harboring some precursor orbs. Three... I don't know how many. Four. Is that it? That's it? That's all you got? He had four precursor orbs on him. So a lot of people miss those because they don't think to jump on them. And honestly, I, I don't blame you. I, don't, I, don't, I wouldn't think to do that either. And aha, that's how I get all those. Nice. Alright, but I actually need to go back in there because I think I missed some. I'm actually about to run over there right now. Ooh. Over there right now. And I died, so these guys are back. But no worries. I'm gonna run over there right now and make sure I got everything out of the temple. That's what I call it. So, or whatever you want. I don't know what you'd want to call it. Now that we killed that monster, the little plant monster too, a cool thing. No more of those flowers. So, um camera. There we go. That's what I was wanting. Uh, but this is a thing you gotta do off to the side. If I'm not mistaken, there's some precursor worms and a scout flight that I guess is. A lot of people miss this too. Not Jagger, not the Titan Twin, baby. So we're gonna grab that, and then we're gonna head back on up this thing and go back inside just for a split sec. Make sure I didn't miss anything. 
Because I'm pretty sure there's at least two more things I need to do inside of here. But that's alright. Knock it out, come back. No biggies, no worries. I guess I need the blue eagle to get up that, huh? Jump. I missed the jump. Jump again. Here we go. Bang. But he's so close to you, dude. I, I miss that almost every time. I miss hitting him. Like, I usually, usually he gets a piece of me. So we'll get back up here, use the button to get back inside. And we're, as you see, we're already knocking things out, guys. We're already knocking things out. There's really nothing to this game, honestly. Again, there's like a couple hard spots, I can't lie, that's going to give me a bit of fits. But nothing overly complicated. I mean, in Banjo-Kazooie, I had some hard spots. This game had some hard spots. So we went in that one. Let's go back up here because this there was a jump thing right here. See more precursor orbs. I got 260, and I'm gonna come to the end again because I can't remember. I don't think there was anything else. But I'm just gonna make sure. The last thing I want to do is not double check myself and miss all the precursor orbs or just three. You know, just like in Banjo Kazooie, we don't want to miss one note. Sorry. Right. Yeah, that was it. We had to come back up there though to get that one jump pad. So good thing we came back. I don't know if I need this anymore. To open that door, but I might. And I do. Is that door? And just back here. We've been in that one. We've been in that one. We've been up there. So actually, yeah, we're done. We're done. Jumped up this one. This leads us to the plant. Uh, got all the precursor orbs out of him. Yeah, we're done. Alright. We're done with this. And now there's no more planned enemies. And no more... Oh, and I think this is cool too. As you see, it's starting to get dark. So I thought that was a cool little effect that the game added. A uh, time change. I thought that was pretty cool. And I think that's it. What we need to do over in this area. So what I'm going to do... So I'm actually going to drop down and... No, I don't want to do this guy yet. I don't want to do that guy just yet. Not just yet. Let's keep on going over this way, see what's going on over here. We already went all the way over there. Make sure I'm not... Oops. Missing any precursor orbs. No, I guess I'm doing that shit too soon. He's fucking me up with it. Yeah, that guy was beating my that snake is fucking me up. I just can't time him. Like he Let's looks closer sometimes. And... The mirror, the yeah, 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 yeah. So we got another scout fly in the black here. That's black in the back there. That's five of the scout flies in the forbidden jungle. Let's go on top of this contraption here. Let's see what's going on. Got a couple precursors you can't miss here. Well, you can miss, but don't miss them. And we see a mirror was built, and it's blocking our light. So go ahead and break the mirror. And this is uh, how we're going to get power back to the city by going to those things and training them all together. So circle the views, and we'll tell you where the next one is. It's right there. You just gotta pretty much run to each one and chain them all back together. All the way back to the city. So I think I'll run around and I'll do this first. And then we'll go explore uh, what's down below that bridge. But uh, yeah guys, we're, we're moving already. That feels pretty good. Watch out, those fish in the water can hurt you. They will cause damage to you. And uh, a lot of these are pretty easy. They pretty much give them to you. So, nothing super, super duper hard, like this one's right here. Oh, I hit the, I hit the fish. Oh, I didn't hit that fish. That's alright. Our next light tower is over here. The next one I'm to our right. Oh, right there. Okay. 
know where that's at. Just across the bridge or just across. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and get this out of the way before I do any more in here. Yeah, that's the easiest way to do it. I guess, I guess just going over here. Oh, on the bridge. Duh. Yeah, and you can see it getting dark out here. I thought that was a nice little effect that they put in the game. Like, a lot of games, you don't see time change. And it doesn't matter if it goes day to night or whatever. It, like, it doesn't have any consequence. But just the fact they added a time change in there, I thought was something uh, pretty cool. You don't see too often. And in a lot of these games, you don't see time change. So Then we got another one here. And I believe we got to do this one, and then we'll have one more. Like this, we'll go to that one, connect it, and then I think we're all done. The power will be back in the city. And that one. Uh -oh. I don't want to talk to him just yet. I want to get this done because this is going to make me leave the Forbidden Jungle for a sec. Um, I'm not going to go all the way back. You know what? Hang on a second. Alright, just remember to check waterfalls, guys, because uh, this game likes to put things in waterfalls. So there's that, over there, and I believe that's going to be it, guys. It's all chained together, they're showing it, bang, 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 and bang. Power is back in the city. We should go tell that windbag of the mayor yes, so. that he owes us big time for connecting the village energy beam. All right, and now we've done a lot actually in the Forbidden Jungle, and we still got a little bit more to do, but we done a lot. We really have already. That was uh, nice, quick, and easy. So what we're gonna do? And we're collecting a lot of power cells, are the precursor orbs. And the thing about the precursor orbs, you already know, I gotta give 90 to that one guy, 120 here I think, you know, for this and that. But that one guy that needs the 120, the, the big statue, we are not going to give him any until I've done all the other guys first. So. There's a guy here we got to do his mini game for power so, and I guess, is he going to over here? No. Yeah. Alright, so we're actually going to do this next, and it's a little complicated. But nothing we can't handle. And, uh. Yeah, we're, we're doing this part. Let's go ahead and get going. What talk about? Damn monsters patrolling the ocean took a bite out of me fishing rig. But now they're gobbling up me catch. No matter what I try, I can't see Damn, sorry, I dropped my remote controller. Woo! Maybe it's your breath. You think you can do better? Try scooping up river fish with a tiny net. I'll give you a power set. If you can catch 200 pounds of them critters, and then I'll let you with shrimp here use my speedboat to get to Misty Island. Alright. So, as you see, we do his little game, he'll give us a power cell, if I'm not mistaken, and the ability to use his little boat to go to Misty Island. So, of course, we gotta do it. Types of good fish to catch. One I'll tell you pound objective fishies here. and five pound fishies. <laughs> If you miss 20 pounds of good fish, All right. then I'm gonna take me net back from you. There are poisonous eels in this river. Now, usually I do this a great even ease, a one of them boogers. but then there are times I completely suck at it. Catch. So just, just bear with me here. Now it's just moving your net side to side, catching the fish. And you don't want to miss none, because once you, what is it, 10 pounds? It takes this net from you. So... Just focus, and the uh, commentary is going to suffer here because it's very repetitive and avoid the fucking eels. Sometimes you want to give up a fish because it's too risky to try and get to it. Because of that damn eel. And as you see, the longer you go, the more you get. The, uh, did I miss that one? Shit. I missed five. Are you serious? Oh, I've missed him too. I'm sucking it up. I've missed, missed, I've missed 11. How much do I gotta miss? 20 Here pounds? Shit! Oh, these little niggas start getting moving. Yeah, yeah. Damn. Oh my god. Alright, try again. Try again. I was missing a lot, but I forget I gotta get, like, right in front of them. 
otherwise they won't count it. Steady boy. And you actually gotta get a lot of fish. This isn't an easy minigame to me, it's very challenging. Because you can't get one eel. And then you see them throw it in there periodically. And then sometimes you just gotta give up on a fish because that eel is just too close. You don't wanna catch that damn eel trying to get your fish. Here comes a big one! Like right here. Just a bunch of fucking eels. Alright, doing pretty good, doing pretty good. This is when shit gets real. Hang on tight. Ooh, that eel. Oh shit. Oh shit, I'm missing him now. Hold so steady. close. There's a bunch of eels. Steady boy. Oh. Now it's avoiding these motherfuckers. You don't even want to catch one, you catch one and you're screwed. Go, got like it. Pounds Took me my fish. second try, but I got it. It's a little tricky. Okay, I can't lie. It's a little tricky, but there we go. Power cell got it. And we can use the man's boat whenever we wish. So, the also thing I find cool about this, it really resembles Banjo 3 a lot to me, is every time you get the power cell or Jiggy, he does a celebration. Banjo did the same thing. So, I find there is a lot. But a lot in common with Game Pass with Banjo Kazooie. So. No, I think it's a pretty cool game. Pretty, pretty cool game. Got another Scout Fly here. Got some precursor orbs over here. Don't want to miss those. And we got this thing here, and we already know it's in these. So, is there anything on these sides here? I know this is the way back up. But is there anything. Just making sure there's no precursor wars on those. And the whole goal is to come down here and get these. And we gotta get this blue, blue, blue eco down here. And as you see, voila! We got our last scout fly. We got the power cell, asshole. Alright, there's that. And we're moving right along. This Forbidden Jungle is about to be done. Going to be dead. Now, as you see, a lot of people miss this too. And how do you dive? Is it square? Is it a dive? Is it a circle? Square. Okay. Square to dive. You can you actually can dive if you see precursor orbs or something in the water. You can actually dive for them. Another power cell. So don't miss those orbs. Don't miss this power cell. It's tucked away back here in the back. A lot of people miss it. Don't miss it. Alright, so get that, and you gotta come back in. And we gotta grab this blue eco and take it back to that vent at the other side. I mean, you gotta, it takes all three, you need all three. We'll come back and use that jump pad in a sec. You gotta grab this one, that one, and that one to get over there in time. And now we rack up on precursor wars. Oh yeah, all 150. Get at you, boy. We're running through this. We are running through this. Literally running through this. Just jump up here. And, uh, ladies and gentlemen, one more thing I gotta do. I gotta open this. Okay. Aha! I see how I do it. I was like, I can't remember how I get in there, but I know I gotta get in there. Can I do this? Can I make that jump? No, you know what? I do it. Get your blue eco from here. Get a little charge right there, and this will be more than enough to get me up there. More than enough. Bang! Forever sale. That's another one people miss, because they don't look around, they don't check everywhere. That's another power cell. So let me check my totals. And I'm missing one in here. What is the one I'm missing? Return to the mayor. Oh, okay. You just gotta go back to the mayor. And then we'll get all these. Bring 90 orbs to the mayor, I'll do. 90 orbs for your uncle. And then the 120 to that oracle, we'll do later. We'll do the 180 orbs to these guys first. And then once we got 240, we'll do the oracle. 
And guys, we're moving. We are. Oops, wrong button. I keep forgetting triangles to get, go back. So, yeah, we are done with the Forbidden Jungle. I'm going to go back, talk to the mayor, who will gently give me my last uh, power cell for the Forbidden Jungle. And I'll get a couple more power cells by giving those guys those orbs. And then we'll be ready to go to the beach to take on the next little bit. But uh, yeah, we're already moving. We're moving pretty well, actually, I think. And uh, once I get these last few orbs, we'll call it a part. I don't want these to be super long, but not super short either. Around 20, 20, in between 20 and 30 minutes, I think is a good, good lengthy video. I know the first two are like 18, 18 or whatever. But all right, we're gonna come to the mayor. We'll talk to the guy. Oh, what a wonderful sight! All right, that's right. Look at that. Look at all that power. Uh, boys, you have restored power to the village and guaranteed my re-election. And for that, yeah, forgive me for having the sn uh, sniffles uh, during my last few videos I've uploaded. Uh, it's December, it's getting, starting to get cold, and then here my, the weather's real messed up. It'll be cold and it'll be hot, and so it's a it's a little little messed up. So it's getting messing with my uh, my nose here. I got a little bit of the sniffles, but. I'm not sick. I'm good to go. So we're gonna trade 90 wards for a power cell. So uh, you uh, want to make a contribution? Good. Uh, a sizable one, I hope. You. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it is a sizable contribution. I, well, 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 I, I, I just hope this power cell adequately represents my gratitude. All right. There's another power cell. There we go. We're starting to knock these out, y'all. We're starting to knock these out. And then we're going to give some more to my uncle who's in here. Weird that this guy's my uncle. And you, you, you never see him again. I see you two are back to make the trade. Like, good, like in the series? Good, jolly good. Hey, I'm, if I'm not mistaken, we don't see this guy again. I'm pretty sure. If someone, uh, said, if we do, if someone knows. I hope you put this hard earned power cell. Please leave a comment down in the, uh, down in the comments below. Leave me a comment. Let me know. I, as, I've played both games, all three games. First of all, beaten all three games, 100 all three games. I don't, I don't think we see this guy again, and he's my uncle. So I just find that very weird. But there we go. We got those. In the next place, we will be tackling, as we view our totals. Sand over the only thing we're missing are the two that the oracles got. Cleared Geyser Rock. We've cleared the jungle. And now we're going to Sentinel Beach, which is going to be a blast and another real quick run through. And I'll stop it right up here. And uh, I'm already, I'm having a blast doing this game, guys. I hope y'all enjoying it. I hope y'all stay with me on this journey. And I will see you in the next part of Let's Play Jack and Dex to the Precursor Legacy, where we tackle the Sen Sentinel Beach, and we will clear it all out 100%, just like we've done everything else. So. I will see you guys next time.